Hello guys, back again. This time we're going to talk about something that back when E3 happened, and I remember a video game news website was interviewing Shaquille O'Neal, and they brought up the point about Shaq Fu, and he teased that there would be future news about Shaq Fu in the near future, and it kind of came off as a joke, and kind of, you know, kind of like maybe he was just trolling the reporter, and he thought nothing, thought nothing of it at the time, and then here we get the news that on Indiegogo, there is a crowdfunding set up for Shaq Fu, A Legend Reborn. Now, they set up the goal for $450,000. Now, unlike Kickstarter, on Indiegogo, you can apparently set it up where, even if it doesn't reach its goal, the developer still gets the money. So, they're asking for 450000 At the time of making this video, they're right now at 69000 but they have 42 days to go. And... A lot of people consider Shaq Fu like the worst fighting game of all time on, in, on the 16-bit generation, one of the worst fighting games. I don't consider it one of the worst. I also understand, again, I was around when the game came out. That was at the time that Shaquille O'Neal was at the highest popularity. I uh, see a lot of people were looking to cash in on him. He was crushing you know, basketball rims back then. He had a rap career back then. You know, He was just a hot item. And so let's make a video game and make it a fighting game. It wasn't the best fighting game. So Shaquille O'Neal obviously didn't want that to be his last go in video games. Didn't want people to remember him for obviously being known for a bad game. So with the new developer, Big D's, they are developing Shaq Fu, a new legend. And one of the things they make quite clear in this video for this product is that the people making this product are, are veterans in the video game making, the video game making, like Halo, Final Fantasy, Battlefield and Street Fighter and Street Fighter is by far the biggest influence you see in this game by watching the trailer and it's just CGI in the trailer I don't think there's no gameplay it heavily looks a lot like its influences actually from Street Fighter 4 that a lot of the same art style so basically they describe this game as basically a, a basically a beat-em-up game with destructible environments with which you're gonna have thousands of enemies to fight you're gonna learn new power-ups you know, and uh, other basic typical stuff from action games. The actual developer himself, uh, the guy running the Big D's, actually said, think Devil May Cry with old school Streets of Rage. That's literally how he described this game. Who knows if it's actually going to reach that, but again, obviously the question was brought up, how come Shaquille O'Neal is not funding this project by himself? And he is putting, I guess, money into the project, the developer is going to put money into it, along with, obviously, the crowdsourcing. And the reason they said they did that was see how many people wanted to go in and investing in the game. Uh, so, there's going to be a Shaq Fu, a legend reborn. And I really do hope, honestly, this is a good game. A solid game. I'm not expecting the greatest fighting game of all time, but I'm hoping it's a game to have fun with, right? I mean, that's what you expect. And so I originally showed this to all my friends, and they were like, they were actually excited to actually invest in this because, you know what, a lot of retro gamers, that game sticks in your mind. Even though you may think it's bad, you'd be surprised how many fond memories you have of playing bad games. And so that would be interesting. I'm, I'm half tempted to actually go in it just to see how this turns out because, uh, you know what, it might be a good game. I hope it's a solid game. I Really, obviously, they're going to do everything they can to make sure it's not a bad game. But what do you think about the fact that they're making another Shaq Fu? Now, again, one of the biggest things is nobody tied to the original game, I believe, is making this. And so, they obviously, this is a game is nothing like the original, which is a good thing. Except for Shaquille O'Neal's in it. So, what do you think about a new Shaq Fu? Would you be interested in actually giving to the new game? Or buying it when it comes out? Or would you be like, you were actually Shaq Fu, the original turned you off, you have no interest in it whatsoever? Or maybe just be a person, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to get it, and if I see that it's decent, I'm, I'm just going to have fun with it. Anyway, love to hear you guys' opinions. I'll talk to you guys again soon. Later.